What is up you guys? Welcome back to CB Outdoors. Today's video is going to be pretty short and straight to the point. Uh, I'm going to show you my hunting setup for this year, my stand and my sticks, and that'll pretty much be it. Today's going to be a very full day. I'm driving to Illinois to see my brother, so I'll probably have that video Tuesday. Hopefully, it depends how well everything goes. Um, I'm actually shooting this on my lunch break right now, which is about to end. So I am going to go to work, finish that up, and then I'll finish recording this video and get it uploaded. Um, it's definitely going to be late because I'm recording it the day it should have been up at 10 o'clock. So I will see y'all after work. Wait. All right, so I'm not exactly out in the woods. I'm actually in the backyard where... I'm gonna show y'all my XOP. Okay, so this year my hunting setup is going to be Hawk Helium climbing sticks and an XOP Evolution. Now the Evolution I got is last year's model, um, but I'm gonna tell you right now this is the most expensive setup I've ever used to hunt with. I have never gone above uh, $100 for one stand. This one was upwards of more like almost three ish there uh, Hawk Heliums are well I got them on sale so I guess not really three I don't know how much they are now um, but when I got them I got them for 100 bucks so the XOP evolution tree stand was last year's model so it was a little cheaper it was 149.99 here it is so this year I have gone all aluminum Right now I'm telling you this setup right here is probably weighing maybe 20 pounds altogether. Um, maybe a little more, 22. Uh, all aluminum, cast aluminum, it's beautiful. I like it. I'm excited to try it out. I'm gonna try and set it up on this tree right here. So this is really a small tree, but it's the best I could get to. I can't really back my truck over there and I don't have a tripod with me right now. So this is what we're gonna go with. This is gonna be one of the easiest stands I've ever put up. I am taking it, if I can get the strap undone. I'm gonna be taking it up north with us when we go. Come on, shoot. I will be documenting that. I don't know if we'll be documenting hunts or not, but we will see. Okay. Minor technical difficulties. Give me a second here. We're back. That took a while, but I got it. So, next time, I know, don't pull this strap out of this stinking can. Okay, so all you do here, right? You come up, you loop around the button here. All right, and now, now our cam right there is set up. So, We'll take that, get it as tight as we can. Okay, now take the secondary loop down here, or secondary cam, right? Loop it around, go around the button, cinch it down, and then you put pressure down here. And your, your stand, whoops. Your stand is good to go. Um, it's got like a leveling feature right here. So say my tree is leaning forward some, I will turn this down here. It'll tilt my seat up for me to level it out. It's super cool. I can't wait to try it out. It's got these little accessory hooks on the side so I can hang my binoculars, um, my rangefinder, which I will be doing a review of because last year I said I would since I used it for a season. Um, and the helium sticks are pretty much the same. I'm sure you can figure out how to use them. Um, you know, I'll just do a quick demo of them. Let me take this down. Okay. It came with these, this weird looping thing. I'm not sure how you describe it. Um, 
I did get some cam straps. I think those will be better for me, but I'm gonna try this. Okay, so you put it on, you bring it around, right? And with these, you go into the closest loop, which is that one. You loop it around, super simple. Uh, and because this came with a bungee, you know, you can wrap your extra back up so you don't let it flop in the wind. Nobody wants that. Um, put it around that loop. Put some pressure here. Open up the feet. There you go. Let's see if I can get on this thing, huh? It's a little high. See? Look at that. I'm on it. So, it's pretty good. Ugh. Sweet. All right, so, that's going to be the end of this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And I know it's short and to the point, but it'll be cool. Um, like and subscribe, I guess. I haven't said that in like a while. Uh, but I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.